What up, boys? Back on Broncos franchise in week five against the Kansas City Chiefs in a rivalry rematch as we beat them on a walk-off field goal in week number three, man. If you didn't see that episode, definitely go check it out. But we got a chance to win again after coming off a blow-off loss. Blowout loss <laughs> to the Carolina Panthers, 52-24 for our first loss of the season. So we got a big bounce back opportunity against the Kansas City Chiefs. And we have a team meeting for a rivalry rematch. Let's get right into it. Let's go, fellas. Looking for revenge. We're hyping everybody up. Rinse and repeat. Complete the sweep of the Chiefs. Chiefs have had this game marked on their calendar. Their players have plus five break tackle play rec for this week's game. Oh my God, that's horrible. That is terrible. We have enough trouble tackling as it is so it's also a heavy rain game so we may need to rely on Javante Williams a little bit more as I'm going to focus on running the football it may be a mistake but we got Ben Powers back we've got Dolchich back um, we should be able to hopefully get 150 plus rush yards we're going to try like hell to get it done and uh, let's get right into weekly strategy we have Everyone back but these three guys. Jonathan, oh, Xavier Leggetti actually is still out. Okay, I'm wrong. So, Ashton Davis, Xavier Leggetti going to miss one more week. Braden Fiske missed five more weeks. Jonathan Cooper with four weeks missed. We do get Ben Powers back. We also get Greg Dolchich back. But Brendan Rice is going to have to play again. He's going to have to play again. He's going to have to step up in a big way. And uh, do just that. Marvin Harrison, Dev Trait Revealed, is X-Factor. Let's make sure we have abilities on him. Because we're, we might need those big time. So, um, obviously, we don't have any apprentices on him. He doesn't play out of the slot. So, I'll do outside apprentice here. And then, um, we'll do deep. He gets deep in elite. And then, I'd like to see um, maybe mid in elite as well so getting good abilities on a receiver is crucial here we know Legetti is now star development he's out this week so brendan rice stepping in we got ben powers back in the lineup big time upgrade at left guard hopefully that helps us run the football better as per is really just the weak point at right tackle right now dolchich back in the lineup a minor upgrade and then defensively brandon jones and caden stearns um JL Skinner playing deep safety kind of sucks. Perkins at other opposite defensive end, not good. But why is maybe let's start Nick Benito. 73 overall over the 66 Perkins. <laughs> Come on, guys. Um Richard Lawrence starting at DT with Fisky out, but Wingo had a sack last week. So maybe something there. But yeah, this is your team. Phillips has star dev. All right, team is set, boys. It is rivalry rematch time against the 2-2 two two Kansas City Chiefs. Let's hope it goes like week three and not how it did week four against the Panthers. Let's dive right into it. Come on, baby. Let's go. Okay, we are here in week number five. And we are taking on the Chiefs at home this time in a rain game. Let's see how the running backs perform. We're going to pound this rock. But we're coming out on defense first, and we need to perform better than we did last week, man. So, blew out at home last week. These fans are expecting a win. Let's come out and punch them right in the mouth, baby. Let's go. Okay, pancake block, and Sanders there to help. Marquise Brown goes down with injury. We may need to turn the injury sliders down. This is, this is bad. Okay, oh... Change of direction by Pacheco. Runs right into the cockroach. Big time losses right now. Xavier Leggetti, Braden Fiske, John and Cooper all out. Nick Benito stepping in for the injured uh, Cooper. And then Rice in for the injured Leggetti. We're going man blitz here. Ah, Kelsey. What's that handoff here? We're going across the field with Barton. And we meet Pacheco at the line of scrimmage. Got to get Kelsey there. We do. Play action. That's Barton. Use your interception. Give me my cookies. Cody Barton. 
with the first linebacker interception of the year, makes two massive plays on that first drive, and gets us the football back. We're going outside handoff here. Big time truck, but only able to pick up three. We will feed Javante. He may push for 25 touches this game. Gonna go mess spot. Sharif! Here we go, buddy. Don't let me down against the Chiefs at home. Don't. We're gonna have Marvin. Marvin was open, but we don't have the time. That is the difficult thing about this team is we don't have time for routes to develop really ever, ever. It's it's very difficult to throw the football. Gonna have, who is that? It's Brendan Rice. Big time pickup for Brendan Rice out of mess spot again. And Sharif comes through for us. Go left side here towards McGlinchey. Set the edge, he does. Javante Williams around the edge and picks up 10. Here we go. No block from Powers, but we're still, still able to get the first. But what the hell is Ben Powers doing? I know he's been out for a while, but buddy, don't be an asshole. Play action here on first down. Got to get the ball out, and we do. Got Javante in the flat. Makes a juke, and it's fourth and two. I'm going for this against the Chiefs. May for first. He gets it. Drake May picks it up with his legs. Holy smokes. That was really good co man coverage by the Chiefs, and Drake May just finds a way to get it done. Third and ten. No! Click the wrong button, and now fourth and ten. This has to be a Bronco field goal. Damn it, dude. Still able to get on the board first, but coming away with three there doesn't feel good. We got to settle in and make our reads. We're playing a little bit jumpy right now. All right, coming back out on defense after the interception by Cody Barton to get us the football and get us three points on the first drive. Mahomes looking out coming looking to come out for revenge here as Stearns was screaming in I was ready for a sack could the Broncos be the kryptonite this season for the Chiefs got to get the run stop here broken tackle come on bro that's me it's throw right at Sanders it's a linebacker pick game Drew Sanders what a play! Two interceptions in the first for Patrick Mahomes. And they're both by linebackers. One by Cody Barton and one by Drew Sanders. Both user picks. And we're hunting for cookies as Javante's going to have space and pick us up a big run. Going outside here. Going outside here. Pick up a block from Dolchich. We've got it! Jukes! Javante, keep going! Down to the nine! What a run! And Javante, seven for 56, is on fire in the rain game. What blocking downfield. Dolchich picked up a massive block. And now first and goal from the nine. We're looking to punch it in right now. Gonna have Drake May with space. Diving! Flipping touchdown! Drake May! What a play! Are you kidding? Diving for the end zone. And we left our feet at the three-yard line, spinning in the air, and broke the plane just barely. I mean, just barely, right there. But, oh my god. What a rushing touchdown by Drake May. And that was all on the ground, that drive, as we get it done. And we're up 10-0 at home. Run play here. We've got guys there. It's Nick Benito getting him in the backfield. Sanders there to set a stone wall. No, Kelsey. Knocked out by Sertan. Let's deep out KO. And that is going to be a Chiefs punt. This defense came fired up, they came pissed off, and they came ready to play. Second and nine now. Nobody open. Tried to check down to the flat. 
the release on May is very, very slow. Third and 17. Got to get, got to get Marvin Harrison. And it's, it's sailed past and honestly probably almost picked off. Should have been picked off. Drake May starting out two for, was that two for eight? Two for eight for 19 yards. We're blessed to be up 10 nothing right now. The fuck did the announcer just say? Got to get it going here. Let's go. Go get him. Go get him. Rip the football out. Play action. Somebody's getting there. It's Phillips. The rookie corner gets the sack on Mahomes. This defense came to play. Wow. That's, oh, I'm there. I'm there. I just can't animate with Sanders. That's me. Right at Stearns and it bounced off my hands. Caden Stearns. It is wet. It is raining. So let's not be too harsh, but man. I mean, Pacheco just fell and then got back up, caught the pass and picked up a first. Play action. Into the flat, make the tackle. Forces him out as Drew Sanders. Outside handoff. He did cross the plane. I thought we maybe stopped him there. Oh, I'm so close. And Rashi Rice gets injured. Wow. The injuries on these sliders are brutal. Stearns gets that one. He grabs it out of the sky. And my user continues to dominate with three total user picks in this game. What is Patrick Mahomes doing? All right. I, I have to audible here and I have to give Marvin Harrison a shot in press coverage. Got him. Got him. Got him. Down to the 44. Voice crack. And what a play. If I see him in press, I got to give him a shot. And Javante. Big game. Nine for 65. By far his best day running the football. And he threw it right to... I mean, that's not where the guy is at all. Three for 10 now. I mean, no. That's not where he's going to be. It's a solid couple... I mean... Marvin Mims diving behind. We're lucky he dropped the football there. Third and two here. Got Brendan Rice who gets around the edge and gets out of bounds at the 35. Brendan Rice stepping up and Drake May finally delivers a ball on the money. Inside handoff to Javante Williams here. Pick up a block. Javante, keep going, buddy. Second and one. Play action. Here we go. Javante picks it up. There we go. Marvin, we couldn't even give him an opportunity. I've never seen Drake May throw the ball this inaccurately through this entire thing. Second and 10 here. Come on. Brandon Rice, give him an opportunity. Out of bounds. Drake May, 5 for 14. This is maybe the worst I've ever seen since like beginning Anthony Richardson in Colts franchise. I mean, this is this is really bad. Dude can't throw an accurate ball. Gonna have space here with his legs though. Go down seven. Fourth and one. We're going for this. Brandon Rice! Wide open and he missed him! He missed him wide open in the end zone! This guy can't deliver an accurate ball once! Ah, that is so fucking frustrating. How many points we probably just left on the board right there. As Drake May is on airmail duty. Bro in, is, is delivering with the USPS and just fucking mailing the football. Javante having a big time game. Let's see what he can do in the second half. We are blessed to be up 10-0 here as we've gotten three First half turnovers from Patrick Mahomes, but got Rice. Got Rice. Hit him in stride. Picks up the first right at the line. Six for 17 for Drake May. Another run on second and 10 here. And it's dead to rights. 
Dead to rights. No blocking. And we're back to our normal bullshit. 13 for 75 here. Third and 10. Let's go. Misses Brendan Rice again, wide open. I'm not even leading him. I'm literally just get, clicking the button, and he just misses the throw every time. Bronco punt. Drake May is single-handedly selling this game for us right now. We should be up at least 17 nothing, if not 20 something nothing. if this guy could just make a fucking throw. He's on pace for the worst completion percentage potentially in NFL history. Big time completion, broken tackle, touchdown, just like that. Marquise Brown to the house. This is why you can't miss throws, because now it is a three-point ball game. Coming back out on offense, man, and I know it's raining, but, I mean, Drake May is struggling heavily to deliver an accurate football. I mean, it's been a real bitch. Pick up big blocks, and we need Ben Powers to get there with a little bit of urgency, man. Holy smokes. Pick up your block, asshole. Got Javante down the field. Javante Williams. Big time play in man coverage down to the 22. We drew it up. That was all hot routes. Great time from the offensive line to get the time to deliver it, and Drake May... Puts it right on the money. Finally. Thank you, buddy. Thank you, buddy. Answer the call. Javante Williams, big time play here. Big time play here. Down to the seven. He's knocking on the door of his first 100-yard rushing game of the season. Let's go. Nope. Powers. Powers with a terrible first game back right now. Just completely missed his block. I mean, let's take a look at this. Powers number 74. Double teams. And then... Doesn't get back in time. Tranquil just blows right past him. I mean, you got to have the wherewithal to see that bro is blitzing and not double team, buddy. I like the run front here. I'm going to give it a shot. I'm going to give it a shot. Second and goal. Going to have it. Going to have it. Fight! And Javante's injured. No! Everyone is getting injured, boys. I mean, this is brutal. It's going to be Jaleel McLaughlin time. Troutman catches through contact, touchdown! What a play! And what ball placement by Drake May as we have now run 20 runs and 20 passes. Perfectly even as we go back up by 10. That is the drive we needed to respond after giving up a massive one-play touchdown. Javante is slightly injured. We're going to keep him in. I, I actually was spamming A to speed up. Didn't even see the injury, so... What play? Stearns fighting through the block and able to slow Pacheco down enough to keep it to an eight-yard gain. Okay, motion. It's a run play here. We got guys all over it, but he is able to pick up the first. Wide open. Pat, make the tackle. Missed the tackle with Sanders. Barton cleans up. Play from these linebackers this game has been nothing short of impeccable. Barton and Sanders have been playing their tails off. Can't get the knockout, and it is a big-time pickup. Rashi Rice getting going a little bit here in the third. Again, Rashi Rice over the middle, bro. It's unstoppable. Rashi Rice gets injured again for the second time this game. Now he's going to the locker room. That could be a big loss and a big break for us. Barton can't get there, and it's a touchdown. Kadarius Tony dives in. 17-14, three-point ball game. Let's go. Let's go. This is where champions are made. We're headed to the fourth pretty quickly here, and we're going to have just over eight minutes for glory here. Want to control clock. Want to run the football as much as possible on this drive. Then Powers gets off, but Brendan Rice can't. Javante dragging forward an 18 for 108 for our running back is amazing to see. I want to develop this guy so badly. So getting him 100 yards is huge. We're going to let this go to the fourth quarter. Let's go, Javante! Javante! Gets it. 
gets it. 19 for 114. Just two weeks ago, we saw him go 19 for 60. Jukes. Oh, oh, so close. Good vision. Javante with Jukes and space down to the 34. 21 for 141 and also has the big time receiving grab. He's closing in on 200 yards from scrimmage today. What a big time day from Javante Williams who cannot be stopped. Mims is wide open. Turn up field. Diving. Knocked out at the one. Power O on the goal line. Let's get Javante a touchdown for his big day. It's going to walk in. Pushing. Fighting. Touchdown. Javante Williams. 24 14. 543 left. Still plenty of ball game, but easily Javante Williams' best game of the season. It's not even close as Drake May struggled and Javante has taken the reins and said, I'll pick up the slack, buddy. I'll pick up the slack. Big time day. There we go. Big time tackle in open space by Mathis. It's a big time pick up to Kelsey right in the zone gap. My God. Stearns grabbed it out of the sky again. He's going to turn the corner. And he's tackled by Mahomes at the 47. Caden Stearns, the kryptonite for Patrick Mahomes. Unbelievable. I'm all over the middle. There's no way. Because this guy's going right, running right into zone coverage. He definitely needs to read Pacheco. Makes the wrong read. I snatch it out of the air. Absolutely snatched. Is that seven or eight interceptions on the year, potentially? Oh, big time gain. Javante Williams, keep going. 24 for 163. Well over 200 yards total on the day. Running again. Javante running rampant. They cannot stop Javante Williams. Out of bounds, but it is, he was open. He had a step and would have caught it in the end zone. That's out of bounds. I mean, under pressure, out of bounds. We're getting blitzed immediately. And up 10, we are going to kick three here to make it a 13-point ball game. Let's go, baby. Let's go. Okay, three minutes left. This one's still not over. Still not over. A touchdown there would have made it a three-possession game and ended the ball game. But we ate up a ton of clock. We just need to stop them here. No, make the tackle. Make the tackle. Are we dragging him forward, PS2? 240 clock ticking. Chiefs need to get down the field. Check down. Inbounds. Big time completion to Tony. Make the tackle. Down to the 36. And that is the two-minute warning. We got two minutes here to hang on against the Kansas City Chiefs. Screenplay. Screenplay. Nobody around. Get Pacheco. He's tackled inbounds. Is he not? Did get out. Right over Stern's head. I can't animate. That would have been ball game. I'm right there. Would have had the hat trick. Oh, no. No, Pacheco. Make the tackle. Minute 29. Swatted down by Brandon Jones. We need everybody to be ready. We need everybody to be ready. Go get him. Go get him. Oh my god, are you kidding? Is that Dawson Knox? The hell is he on the Chiefs? And now it's 21 to 27. Oh man, we could not run away with this game, could we? Chiefs answer. Three timeouts still. It's gonna be an onside kick. We got the hands team out here. 
Get it. There we go, baby. Johnson, hands on the football. No clue who that is. We're knocking on the door of field goal range. Bounce it all the way outside. Javante, north, south. Second and one. One yard ices this ball game for us. We got it. We got it. Ball game. Broncos win, and we sweep the Chiefs as we get the W 27-21 in the rain behind a massive performance from Javante Williams and this defense who picked off Pat Mahomes four times. Okay, here we go. Let's take a look at the stats as we get the W 27-21, but look at that Drake May completion percentage. 37.5% completion. That's unbelievably bad. Um, nine, he, he was so bad completing the pass. He Pat Mahomes threw four picks and still got a better passer rating than him. But 74.6 passer rating for May. 9 of 24, 158, and a touchdown. 99.9 .9 for Mahomes, 22 of 30, 310, three touchdowns, four picks. Rushing, Javante Williams took over in the second half 28 for 192 and a touchdown um three broken tackles two 20 plus yard runs pacheco 10 for 41 may six for 19 and the diving touchdown as well and then mahomes had two for eight receiving seven for 57 for pacheco five for 86 for rice three for 58 for williams so williams goes for Literally 200, exactly 250 scrimmage yards for Javante Williams. Canaries Tony, three for 40 and a touchdown. Brennan Rice, three for 34. Kelsey, three for 35. Knox, one for three. Moore, one for 14. Troutman, one for one and a touchdown. Marquise Brown, one for 71 and a touchdown. Marvin Harrison, only one grab for 41 yards. And then... One for 24 for Mims. Braylon Allen, the rookie running back for the Chiefs, had one grab for four yards. And then defensively, sack-wise, Andrew Phillips got one. And then Trice and Nadi had one as well. Really good protection this game. I think getting Ben Powers back was a major addition as we were only sacked once. Interceptions, two for Stearns, one for Barton, one for Sanders. Four user picks in this game. We showed the hell out and showed why nobody lurks like death. <laughs> and we get the w 27 21 let's go 23 coach points as we did rush for 150 yards which was the goal and caden stearns gets an overall boost up to a 78 overall player man he's been incredible and proving to be a fantastic user I have no doubts that he will be X-Factor very, very soon and will develop to a 99 overall. Honestly, one of the more fluid users. He feels so fluid on the field. It feels unbelievable using this guy. I mean, we've already got, what, eight interceptions through five games and didn't have one last any last week. So he's been um, he was unbelievable. Rivalry matchup here. We did sweep the Chiefs. Let's see what we get for it. Legion of Broom. Sweep of the Chiefs as the team fired up. Plus 15 morale for everyone and 10 staff points. Was hoping for a little bit of XP, but we don't get it. And then the rain game here. Let's see what we get for winning in the rain. Um, who do I credit most? Honestly, a lot of our offensive line will be replaced. So I'm going to credit the running backs, man. Plus three carry and break tackle for next game for Javante Williams. Nothing major. I was expecting that to be a lot better. But that's going to be it for this one, boys. We beat the Chiefs 27-21. We complete the sweep. And apparently, we are just the kryptonite for Patrick Mahomes, man. Um, but we did get blown out in week four. So a big bounce back win. We take on the Patriots in week six. Hopefully, in week six, we get another W. But you never know, man. It's every week is, is independent as the Panthers were really bad overall. And they smoked us. So I'll catch you guys there, man. Appreciate you guys running up this series. If you did it enjoy the episode make sure to drop a like and let me know in the comments what you think the final record of this team will be i'll catch you guys in week six appreciate you so much peace